Hello and welcome to today's chemistry class for SS1. Our topic today would be introduction to chemistry. Lesson objectives. At the end of this lesson, the students should be able to define chemistry, give examples of chemical changes that happen around us, mention some professions that require And so let's move on. Chemistry is a branch of science that deals with the composition, properties and the uses of matter. Chemistry also deals with the study of our environment and explaining things that are happening in the environment. Now, have you ever wondered why we study chemistry? Our world is made up of matter. We study chemistry to acquire knowledge about matter. We perform experiments and learn how to observe, record, and make intelligent inferences. Chemistry may be divided into three main parts. One, inorganic chemistry. This deals with matter in our environment, which is non-living. I'm referring to non-living things in the environment. Two, organic chemistry. This deals with the study of matter found in living things, both plants and animals. Physical chemistry. This deals with the study of energy changes accompanying different transformations of matter. And so, let's take some examples of chemical changes that happen around us daily. Lighting a matchstick, rusting of nails and metals, burning of wood and other materials, cooking of food, growing of trees. Let's take a look at different careers that are possible in chemistry. There are many job opportunities for students with knowledge of chemistry. The public and private sectors of the economy which offer such opportunities include the teaching profession. With good knowledge of chemistry, you can work in the health services, like being a medical doctor, a nurse, or a pharmacist. You can also work in the food processing sector. Petroleum and petrochemical industries will receive you with open arms if you are well grounded in chemistry. You can also work in the manufacturing industry. Agriculture and forestry is also another lucrative place where people with knowledge in chemistry can work. Summary. In this class, we learned the definition of chemistry, different chemical changes that happen around us daily, different professions that need chemistry. Now, let's take some assessments to see how far you have learned. 
Chemistry is defined as A. A branch of knowledge which produces chemicals B. A branch of science which makes physics and biology clearer C. The oldest branch of science D. The branch of science which deals with changes in matter Question 2 Chemical changes around us include all the following except A. Rusting of iron nails B. Fading of colored clothes C. Sieving D. Decomposing of green leaves in a compost Number 3 One of these professions has no need for chemistry. A. Miners B. Engineers C. Philosophers D. Geologists Number 4 One of these is not a chemical change. A. Rusting B. Sublimation of solids C. Slicking of quicklime D. Fermentation of glucose With this, we have come to the end of this lesson. Thanks for watching and see you in the next class.